I'll tell you what, I'll give you the Boomer 250 and the Ameritron, and the Ameritron. That's about $1,600 worth of equipment. If you do the piss test with me on the YouTube camera, I'll give it to you free, just to do the test. Uh, you can keep your Ameritron on, I don't want Alright, that's all I got enough to say, guys. Uh, you know, trust me, there are a whole lot of people out here that really wish I was some kind of any kind of junkie other than the big Molly loving, oh, smoke more than Molly and Peter Tosh Pothead, the Banugi King by Kwa. You know, I ain't got no drugs in my body. Never did, never. All right, tell him, meet Richie, take the piss test. Tell him, meet Richie, take the test. Watch what happens. Smoke your crack, smoke your K2, none of that shit, Richie. Never did it. See, Richie, I get high in life. Yeah, he's crying, bro. A lot of plea cops, man. I tell you, you know what, guys? I I'm honestly glad that uh, none of you cats got a man you all never met that you scared the living shit out of and punked out of a manhood out here every day in the morning playing you up like that, you know? What, what, what that is is... uh. Jilted homosexuality. He's very jilted and irate that Richie's a, oh, a, a heterosexual technician. Adios. Uh, that, that, that kills him there. You're hole in the wall, Brooklyn, New York CB shop. Your CB 19 NYC video game is rolling. And NYC Radio Wars, the playlist on YouTube. The truck driver's best friend. When they can't get by that radio, but gotta have a radio fix. The King is Club. Take the piss piss. If force are deathly afraid, scared to do that, bro. You got I tell you what, you guys start pushing up on a meet him, take that test. We wanna see the we wanna see true dead justice. It'll never happen, dude. You got a better chance of winning the lottery or meeting my daddy. I'm telling you what that man all about. You wanna know what that man all about? Go sit through NYC Radio Wars, Truth and Justice. One video from beginning to end. And if you tell me that ain't a junkie, I'll hang it up. Well, why would you want to look at his penis on YouTube? Take it a bit, just a fancy, man. Ah, nah, we'll be nice. We'll keep the camera above the waist. Uh, all, all we're video gain really is the results. The fact that we're both there doing it and the results. What happens to that shit afterwards? What that test chart says. So, yeah, man. Ah, you know what? I think if Channel 19 pushed up for that, man, you could alleviate a whole lot of shit out here in the early morning. But hey, who the hell am I? I'm just your hole-in-the-wall king that about 14 months ago, Crazy Eddie begged and pleaded with me to come down here because we got some jerk-offs talking about me. Anyway, the king of New York, I'm back quiet. You talking to me? Eddie, I don't talk to you, dude. I step on your fag ass. Although I gotta give your kid brother credit. Your brother seems to think, uh, he told me last year you're coming to meet me. You're coming to meet me to bring your beef. I told him I won't hold my breath. I'm glad to see your kid brother fears you. <laughs> oh, you little abuser. Yeah, guys. You ought to push up for that, uh, Truth and justice. I think uh, I think uh, I think an eyeball. I think a uh, two instant test. Actually, we'll do four, so I could just show him that uh, I never contracted his monster while I did all those drugs with him. He's bragging about. You know what I mean? We could do. Uh, actually, now you know what? I, you know what? I'll do anyone he wants to do. Uh, the narcotics is mandatory, you know, because I, you know, I hate to hear a guy out here trying to convince the public that I'm his right-hand man and his drug-smoking buddy. Especially a cat that I never met. A cat that went out of his way and bought a special pair of gloves that he tried to convince all y'all for six months he was going to use to beat me up. I don't know, guys. Maybe I got the game twisted and fucked up out here. 
Maybe I lost my manhood somewhere along the line. Hey, Richie, stay away from the monster. I am the monster, dude. You know what I mean? When you do what I do out here, you're, you're every con artist, every type of drug addict, with every communicable disease under the sun. And that's the uh, paying the cost to be the boss. Like I said, y'all cats out here that gotta be out here every morning that would rather not hear me stepping on the whole world, push up for that meeting, guys. Push up for that, those two tests. And we can put it, you see how silent they got? You know what time it is, fellas. Act like a man. Pull a manhood. Pull a card. Put them on the spot. And the spot disappears. Hey, so you gonna check your prostrate and your cola cans? Happy Halloween, guys. What happened, Enforcer? You figured out that they were getting ready to put you on the spot and show you to show and prove truth and justice? Aw, oh, what happened? It's all bullshit. Especially when it comes out of the mouth of the man who claims he's delivering truth and justice. One video, NYC Radio Wars, Truth and Justice. The first video, you want to hear him crying like a baby? Check out the couple videos down called Peace Offering. <laughs> Well, you know something, Debo? Only a low-life scumbag like you would think like that. I'd rather find a way to put a stop to the bullshit so I don't have to decide which side of the scum line I want to lay on. <laughs> hey, you call me a low-life... <laughs> you call me a low-life and you got the monster, damn it, boy. Hey, Debo. An hour against your manhood and the crack whore mother that gave up uh, birth to you? I'll take a test with you instant on camera. And I bet you I'm clean as hell. You know what I mean? That's all what they started out here. They want to try to damage me in every way. Because they know my accounts are about to unfreeze. And I'm going to warehouse these five boroughs worse than Crazy Eddie did. In the style of one of the men who raised me. The real Crazy Eddie Antar. Oh, the king got down. Man, <laughs> your ass go crack for real, driver. You want to take a piss test with another grown ass man? I think you want to put some big lanes on your goddamn YouTube page. Say it ain't so, driver. What I'll say, Debo, is when I got a punk bitch like you, bona fide faggot, accusing me of having some communicable fatal disease. I, you know, it's, it's a very incriminating, uh, it's a very bad allegation. So by me doing something like that to show you that your word is about as much as your asshole's worth when it grips around the next dick, you know, to me it's worth it to do. Damn it, boy. <laughs> yeah, you know what I noticed, Debo? I noticed in the last three years, dog, whenever I get you good, all you do is laugh. You know why? Because you really are a faggot hot, man. Jermaine was right about you. Hey, Richie! Hey, Richie! Actually, uh, Debo, Debo got a problem. Debo doesn't have to decide on what side of the scum line he wants to lay on. He wants both sides of the line because all he wants to do is swallow that scum.
goddamn water game rolling? Do you goddamn water game rolling? Yo, Richie, I got some K2, man. You wanna buy it? Nah, Richie wanna take pictures of people taking urine tests. He ain't trying to get a urine test. He wanna take a picture of that penis so he can put that shit on the water game. I don't know. Yeah, trying to get that hand glow, but he stopped it. Hey, Debo, I ain't the one running around with the handle Debo, which is fag slang for deep bowels. <laughs>